Hi everyone, welcome to Straight from the Divine Tarot. We are Thursday, May 2nd, 2024. I'm here to do a collective read for you guys. As you know, it is a timeless read. I don't use the signs, I don't use the genders, because it's all energy as well. So if this is your reading, you're going to know from the description of the characters as well as the storyline. So take what applies, toss the rest, don't try to make things fit. If it doesn't, not advisable, okay? I will be using the he and she pronoun just to keep it straight in my head, no other reason. So if you have to switch the genders and or the roles throughout the read, go right ahead. That's not a problem. Just remember, it's a general reading. There's thousands of people here, lots of energy. Not every read's going to be for you. And even if it is for you, chances are that most, well, some of it, pardon me, some of it won't resonate with you. Uh, that just simply means that it belongs to someone else. Leave it alone, okay? Like I said, there's lots of different energies here. Um, I'll bring out the tarot cards. I'll give you the description of the card as well as what I'm picking up intuitively. You know your story best. It could be all the descriptions, some, one, and or none, as I said. And then we bring it together at the end. If you wouldn't mind, if you haven't done so already, please hit the subscribe button. Join this beautiful soul tribe. I'd be forever grateful. Uh, and if you don't, thanks for stopping by. But at least, you know, leave, leave a like if you wouldn't mind. Um, all of you, please. It's uh, an equal give and take, right? I truly appreciate it. And I thank you guys for being here. Thank you for all the love, the support, the super thanks, donations. I'm truly grateful. Thank you so very much. You guys are wonderful. You really are. I love you. Let's see what spirit has, huh, shall we? Spirit guides, guardian angels, ancestors, the white light. Okay. So somebody's unaware. Awareness in reverse. So this is a magician in reverse in tarot. Somebody's very manipulative, deceptive. Okay, two-faced. I heard two-faced big time. Um, corrupt. Deceptive. A lot of manipulation going on. It could be magic as well. This is the overarching energy. Not good. Underlying energy. Financial and material changes in reverse. So it's a high Five in reverse is the Hierophant in reverse. You could be dealing with a high priest or priestess, a dark one doing energy manipulation against you or they broke the law or it's a false contract of some sort or it's a divorce or a separ separation that's involved here we'll see okay if somebody doesn't have any faith uh, or they don't value traditional values and or relationships it could be any of these things okay so we have yeah they're, maybe they're trying to attack your sacral chakra but they can't it's just too bad for them too high priestess or priest it could be very very intuitive yeah love begins because you love yourself. You, you, you are very loved. I just heard that. Love begins. It's beautiful. Hmm. They're trying to affect your third eye chakra. It's not going to happen. Six. Poor decision here, okay? They're not of the light. Yep. Six, 19 in reverse. They're sick. This is somebody is hiding, cloaking, doing stuff in the dark. Not happy. Yeah, this is chaos. This is fertility in reverse, okay? Fertility in reverse is the empress in reverse. Somebody's very chaotic and toxic. You're dealing with a doppelganger, possibly, and or they want power control over you. They're trying to affect your third eye chakra. Ain't going to happen. Yeah, positive movement forward. Yeah, because you're moving forward and you're doing well. This is something that's happening too quickly, according to them. It's not them to, It's not up for them to decide your destiny. You're going towards your destiny quickly and they don't like it. Too bad. They're gold diggers and cloud chasers. You're going to get some communication and or some action going on here. Um, there's a lot... It's going to be happening in the next little while, okay? So, I can't really talk about it right now, but, yeah. Wait and see. Something beautiful is going to be coming, okay? So, we have Awareness 1 in Reverse. Financial and Material Changes 5 in the Reverse. Give me some more clarity upon this, please, Garrett. Where are we going with this? So this is the bottom of the deck. Sorry. We have conceded. Somebody's got a huge ego. Thinking they could just do whatever they want. Bottom of the deck. Social services. Well, so they're going to lose their social services. Good for them. You know, when you play with people, that's what happens. It comes back to bite you one way or another. Um, confidence. They don't like your confidence. Or they're a confidence man or woman. A con man or a woman. Okay. So long distance and travel. Somebody's very petty and cruel. Call children's aid on you or they're dealing with children's aid or somebody's working for children's aid. They got a lot of fetishes. Ew. Coward. Yep. Exactly. Corruption and vice. Yep. One night stand. Ew. Parent, step parent. Out of control. 
A lot of manipulation. I was picking that up, and they're very disrespectful. Somebody abroad or overseas, or maybe you're going abroad or overseas. Somebody mm, sexy. Maybe they find you sexy, or they're trying to use sex to get their way. It's a co-worker, and they're trying to do this to you, okay? Truth. Some truths are coming out. So somebody was conspiring to, to do something against you, because it's the inheritance again. And they're gold diggers and cloud chasers, okay? And they're very, very false, and they're very selfish. They slandered you, rumors and gossip, and there's a lot of drama, okay? So I'm picking up. This person's in for a big surprise. Okay, something's happening quickly to these people. I do know that in my situation and your situation, the divine has told me what's happening. Um, it's about time. So we have awareness one in reverse, conceited and ego. I go that ego. <laughs> Gonna be an ego death maybe. Awareness in reverse. Conceited ego. Caught in the case. There we go. Sexual infection, sexual disease, rush, etc. So I was picking up in a couple of reads. Your family could have set, it, set you up with a, a lover that was infected with a, a terminal illness. And they planned on infecting you. One way or another. If you didn't give in to this person's ploys, they were going to just do it against your will. If you, if you know what I'm saying. So if you're triggered easily, please... Log off, I understand. But somebody has a case here. Okay, they're car carless. No car, repo, and car issues. So I'm also picking up somebody here is on social services for the drugs they need for this terminal illness. Uh, they're getting cut off, therefore they're not getting that um, they're not getting their drugs or access to their drugs because they're carless. They can't make their appointments. Boss daddy. Stable, rich business owner, CEO, Big Dick Energy is coming in. Congratulations. Congratulations. There's an offer coming in. Somebody's, someone's a drama starter. They don't want you co going towards this, or this could be you. Okay? Drama starter. They, they eat shit. Okay? They think they're all that in a bag of chips or nothing. They're, they're going to come towards you and kiss ass now. Right? Because they want, you, they want you to give... Them money and or whomever this is, they want them to give them the money. Somebody's creeping around, watching you, threatening, okay? Intimidating, threatened, bothered. You're unfazed. Yeah, I get a lot of threats too. Yeah, bye. They're a thief. Robbed, lo robbed, lost, that physical or emotional. Trying to impersonate you, I told you. Doppelganger wants to be you, acts like, dresses like, looks like, and copies you. Same shit, different day. Well, it's going to change very soon. You heard it right here, okay? It's changing. It's going to be dramatic. It's going to change. Awareness in reverse. One, conceited ego, caught a case. They also could have went around and said that you have a terminal illness, which you don't. That you know, sexual ter that you got sexually. Because they oh, suppose you're a whore, male or female, doesn't matter. You sleep around, you're in the orgies. They really try to disgrace you. They said the worst of the worst, you know, and hoped it stuck. They threw whatever they could towards you, whatever lies, and hope it stuck. So you're going to be, uh, not only some of these people are going to be arrested, but some of these people are going to be sued for everything they own. Awareness, one in reverse, conceded, caught a case. Where are we going with this? Help me understand, please. Conflict. Yeah, you're avoiding all conflict. You're not into it because this was in reverse, right? Differences, disputation. And quarrel. No, you're not fighting them. Say what you want to say. I'll see you in court. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Yeah, somebody's got a huge pride. Self-esteem, self-worth, and ego. They got a lot of pride here. Too prideful to ask for help and or just to admit they were wrong. But on the other hand, be proud of what you've had to endure and got through. Okay? You overcame quite a lot. You're hitting your goals here. Congratulations. saving somebody's trying to hit, hold you back from your goals yeah you're very committed and maybe they don't want to be committed they wanted to bind you to them obstruct you wow wow we did see the m word now it's this okay something's over here they're committed to doing this ending you and or ending something in your life they want you lonely i think they're going to head towards that they want to stop you you're persevering. You're jumping over these hurdles. No problem. That's a loss to them. Mm, too bad. 
you do shit like this, too bad. I don't have any sympathy, okay? It is what it is. Do you want to hurt people? Do things behind closed doors like magic? Lie? Spread rumor, gossip, and slander about a person to hurt them? How fucked up do you have to be to do that to people? Hmm? To ruin their business, ruin their lives? Really, yeah, this is unfair. Whatever they did, they wanted you struggling. They tried to sacrifice you here. This could be fraud as well. They're stuck. Oof. They want to hold on to some money that's not theirs. There you go. It's the inheritance. Yep. They're grieving and regretting. There's a lot of fighting, conflict. I think people are waking up. People in these in this situation, whether it's professionals, family, friends, love, they're all waking up as to what they did to you, okay? What they, yeah, you walked away, or they're all walking away from this Yahoo, okay? Yeah, this person's unstable. They could have ran up your, your credit as well, I just heard, for some of you, not all. They wanted you to seem unstable, can't have... You can't manage your thing, your your affairs. They thought they'd run up a, you know, ruin your credit and then walk away. No, 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 no. It's not going to happen like that. That's fraud, okay? Awareness in reverse. Conceited ego. Caught a case and conflict in reverse. They want to cause so much shit in your life, but it's not working out to their advantage here. Why? Well, because you're divinely protected. That's why. And it is the year of karma. Thank you, Spirit. <laughs> oh, they're having an emotional outburst. They don't want you having any beginning. That's just too bad. They might say sorry, but they're not sorry. Um, they're emotionally manipulative, okay? They're very Im immature and insincere. They're feeling rejected and abandoned, or they wanted you rejected and abandoned. Not going to happen. Overarching energy. They don't want you leaving. They, you know. They might want to come back to you, whoever this is, Eight of Cups in Reverse, or they're refusing to move on. Um, they have to settle with you, possibly. Oh, yeah. They've been stopped here. Like carless. They lost the car. They're going to have to hoof it now. Yeah, Shoe Leather Express. Congratulations. Hmm. Something's not moving forward any longer. This is something that's out of control. Could have had a car accident. They can't walk away from this car accident. Or they could have stolen a car. But they're carless now. Maybe you don't have a, a driver's license. Maybe they defrauded you and bought a car under your name. You don't even have a driver's license. You know what I'm saying? They're trying to be you. Maybe they got caught in a car accident or got pulled over and used your ID. Okay. They have to come back. They're not getting away with it. It's out of control. They don't want to take accountability, but... Oops, sorry. Flipped over twice. Eight of Cups in reverse. Chariot in reverse. Why, why is it here, please? Yeah, they're jealous. They're doing magic. You could have caused somebody a car accident by using magic. Good for you. If it's a dark high priest or priestess, they did something to you and they got into a car accident. They're not walking away from this. Or they got pulled over. Somebody's very jealous, abusive. Hateful, spiteful, could have said you were a whore. Maybe they got caught with a whore in their car. This is all scam, okay? Doing spell work, it's a scam artist. So he's very insincere. It's a love bomber. They could come after you until they get what they want and then they're gone. I'm, I'm picking up energy uh, harvesting. Be careful. But it's also this inheritance, whether it's spiritual or 3D or both, okay? Yeah, they were plotting and planning. Somebody at a distance. They were plotting and planning this. You've turned your back on this person. Yeah, inheritance, what I tell you. Wow, scam artists, family, it's for this inheritance, spiritual, 3D or both. You have long-term stability, long-term st I, I'm picking up, oh God, they've been doing this. they got to balance something out. They were playing games with you, two of pentacles at the bottom of the deck. You're in alignment here. They were juggling you if this is somebody you were with. This is love, new love, true love, self-love, emotional fulfillment and happiness, emotional st support. Your cup runneth over. They're crying now because they got caught and they have to come clean. Wow. You're getting your wish fulfillment, okay? They were very greedy. Two of Pentacles in the upright. Ace of Cups in the upright. Seven of... Come on. Sorry, it's my fault. Two of Pentacles in the upright. We have to balance something. Come on. 
It's almost like somebody out there don't want me talking about it, but they're not going to stop me. <laughs> Bunch of bozos. Two of Pentacles in the upright, Ace of Cups in the upright, Seven of Swords in the reverse. Grieving and regretting, crying over spilt milk. Very disappointed. They're crying over what they lost, wasn't even theirs, okay? You had a, some sort of relationship with them, whether it's love, family, friend, whatever, partner uh, in business. You were there, you were solid, they ignored you, they put you last. Good for you. So they're not happy now. Oh, they're hiding stuff in the dark. Oh, they could be sick as well. They're not happy that your ships are coming in, you're moving on. You're expanding your horizons. You've turned your back on these people. You're not looking back, okay? You're prepared and preparing for something. You know what's coming towards you. And they don't like it. Yep, they've been stopped. They're trying to stop you. They can't escape. They can't move on. This is They're in trouble here. They were stopped by this emperor, or this could be you. They're trying to stop this emperor. Or you, this emperor, whomever this is, stop them. So they bossed them and took back their power. They can't escape this. Yeah, that's it. Ten of, uh, Ten of Swords. Okay, this was a harsh and painful end. This was the ultimate betrayal. This could be somebody in a power position, a leader, a father, a, uh, a boss. Somebody that's established, has connections, wisdom, experience behind them. Yeah, this is financial ruin, spiritual jail. They're under divine judgment right now. They want to come back in from out of the cold. Yeah, no, it's, it's ruined. They want it to ruin you. They want a power of... Power and or control over you or power of attorney over you or this was a doppelganger trying to be you, okay? So maybe this emperor is somebody that you were dealing with in the past. Husband, boyfriend, whatever. It could be also a female in this energy. Um, maybe chose a, a karmic over you, a divine being. Thinking that they can take your inheritance. <laughs> I don't think so. And what fucked up world is that? They're karmic. Yeah, you part of ways. Lack of trust. They're karmic. Wow. Knight of Pentacles in reverse. They've been stopped. They didn't give you your money. This is somebody that's very unfaithful, unreliable, not dependable. They're very immature, irresponsible. They're lazy. They could have intercepted your mail or your money somehow online. They didn't give you your money. Somebody's gathering some information. They're trying to stop you. If you're um, a card reader of any kind, they're st trying to stop you. They can't come correct to give you this money. You're starting something new or they're trying to stop something new that you've started here, a new, new opportunity. You took a practical approach. You did your homework. Somebody's doing their homework here. Yeah, you have no burdens. You, you're not taking on these people's burdens. You made a conscious decision to not take on their burdens and put this, put it all down. You're not carrying their, their shit, okay? You're unfazed, unworried, unbothered. You ended this cycle a long time ago. Maybe it's just catching up to these yahoos, right? Page of Pentacles in the upright, Ten of Wands in reverse. Yeah, you're not. Yep. And blocked them. They didn't see that coming. Yeah. You healed your own heart. They're in denial. They're trying to block something from you. They're acting um, like a victim now because you're not helping them. Well, that's too bad. They tried to help themselves to your life, to what what you own, what is rightfully yours. They don't see this coming, like I said, okay? This is the end. They didn't see the end coming. Yeah, this law and order. This could be Archangel Michael, too. Somebody sees the truth. They're going to be speaking the truth. This could be you, them, male, female, doesn't matter. You are speaking the truth. Uh, it could be law and order. It could be a lawyer. It could be a judge speaking the truth. He's got the sword in his hand. He's going, this is the absolute truth. This is somebody that's very wise and mature. They don't listen to histrionics. They go with the facts and only the facts. They don't listen to third-hand information. They actually do their homework and look. They'll look into it, right? Yeah. They gave out false information about you. Somebody could be a doctor too. Could be a, anybody in law. Somebody with authority. They see that they gave out some false information about you. Try to traumatize you. It was unrequited love. Whatever this was, was not an equal give and take at all. And you're not going back to the past. Yeah, King Pentacles, they were cruel. This was corruption, abuse of power, abuse of authority. Somebody's very unstable. A codependent, clingy, a bully. Okay, they're very materialistic and greedy. Lazy and jealous. They only care about their image and what money can buy. A spendthrift, right? Yeah. 
They're very jealous of you. Six of Cups in reverse, King of Pentacles in reverse. They wanted you unstable. Yeah, they didn't want you having a new beginning, okay? They wanted you feeling rejected and abandoned. There's a lot of lies and secrecy here. Could also be male or female because of somebody's jealousy and, and, and greed. They lost a child. They know that you know you're a high priestess, male or female. A lot of secrecy going on here. But you are you have wise counsel here. You, you're very wise. You're balanced between your dark and light. Masculine, feminine. You have a direct connection with source as well. Yep, they have to let something go, release something. They can't hold on to you or hold on to this money any longer. They forced your signature. Woo. So they could have gotten this money released in the past by forging your signature and impersonating you. They felt entitled to this, to hold it, to hold back, to hold this money away from you. And now they're getting bothered here. They're not eating. I mean, like you. They've been sitting on the truth for a long time. You've healed. You're at peace. They're ra I think what they're doing now is they're... Yeah, you're the empress. They slept on you. Put it that way. You've healed. You put things to rest in your life. You're at peace. You're the empress here. They've been sitting on the truth for a long time. Yeah, you're out in the public eye. This is victory, success, reward, recognition. There's an investigation. You're alone. You went within. You did that soul work. Congratulations. There's an investigation of some sort. Something's coming out publicly, one way or another, either on public record or publicly on the news or in your community. Everybody knows the truth here. They're being investigated. You're shining a light on this bullshit one way or another. Congratulations. This is a road. You're on your journey, spiritual journey. This is a road only you can walk. They, you can't bring them. They can't come with you, okay? You're going to be hitting a big one way or another, and they're going to want to come in with you. But no, you stay right where you are, okay? They made their choices. Lovers, they made their choices. Like I said, they made a decision. They put you in a third-party situation or a contract. Uh, but you used your higher wisdom here. This is a contract. Something's happening quickly. Could be the sheriff, bailiff, and or police coming through. Yep, with the truth. Wow. This is a breakthrough. Congratulations. This is clarity. There's communication coming through. Somebody lied about you. They were jealous. Okay? They were very vindictive and vile. And they wanted to slow down your destiny. Okay, they caused a lot of stagnation and delay and setbacks in your world. But the, what they didn't realize is you're always where you need to be. This this was ordained. This needed to happen. It's for your elevation. Also, I mean, the divine's not going to just take care of one problem in one fell swoop. It's going to take care of multiple problems here. By you waiting a little extra long, you're never late, okay? This, you're right where you need to be. This is a reversal of fortune, a change of direction. They're getting some karma. Family, a group, four of wands. Something to do with a home, a business, and or property. You're stable and secure or a marriage. Yeah, and you're stable and secure. What can I say? They want to reconcile with you. Family or somebody. Yeah, somebody was smug, full of themselves, selfish, and out all in the show off. They could have said that you're drinking. They want you to go back to their drinking days. Maybe, sh stupid. Anyways, this is a fall from grace. This is not no emotional fulfillment or happiness. They were putting on an act trying to be you, spreading egregious gossip here. Ever since you parted ways with them, they could have been dealing with covens, secret societies, cults. I'm not putting them down. I'm just saying there's bad apples everywhere you go, okay? Yeah, they tried to sacrifice you. And now justice is here. Now they're stuck, okay? They didn't want to compromise. They didn't want to uh, cooperate with you. They don't want to look at things from a different perspective. They wanted you struggling after you're, you left these people, right? Justice is coming up their ass right now. Justice. Bringing back balance, okay? Whatever happened here was amoral or criminal or both. It wasn't fair. It wasn't just. It wasn't balanced. Now it's going to be balanced, okay? They're struggling with something. Yeah, you saw through the illusions. You broke free and you, you detached from these people. 
they made some accusations about you that they can't back up. They didn't protect you or defend you, your honor and or your interests. They're feeling defeated and overwhelmed right now. They could be under spiritual attack because they wanted to attack you. Okay. Now they're feeling sorry for themselves here. Okay. Left out in the cold. Or maybe in the past, that's what they wanted for you. They didn't defend you. They were attacking you with spell work, blah, blah, blah. So you wouldn't notice them stealing in the background your inheritance. You know what I mean? I think they're feeling sorry for themselves because they sold their soul to do this. And it didn't work. <laughs> to sacrifice you. It didn't work. Yep. No divinity. They have no faith. They have no spiritual protection. This is, they're feeling ashamed of themselves. They could be very sick at this moment, losing hope. Yeah, they're, getting, they're homeless. They stole a home. It could be mortgage fraud or business fraud. If, whatever this is, the party is over. Somebody's non-committal, possibly. They're very unstable. They said that you were mentally and emotionally sick or unstable. They could have even said that you had an STD. Yeah. They wanted to, you to fight. They wanted you to fight so they could prove you're unstable, unworthy of this money. Or this, you know, this this inheritance. They wanted you to fight and compete with them. Nah, ain't gonna happen. Now they're all fighting and competing with one another. This is a lot of jealousy, competition, conflict, jealousy. This is chaos. This is a rivalry and drama. That yeah, like the magic, chaos, magic, and conflict, magic. A lot of illusions here. Ma they were manipulative. They were two faced. Uh, yeah, they're they're bound now. They wanted to bind you. They're bound now, and or they're going to jail. Okay. This is all self-imposed. Too many obstacles to overcome. They're stuck in their head, or they wanted you stuck in your head. They wanted you homeless. They claimed you were homeless. Probably living on the streets. The same story. You're living on the streets. You're homeless. Uh, you have drug addiction. You you're a drunk. You're a whore, male or female. You're selling your ass. They were hoping for that so they can disappear you and claim your money. Claim claim their karmic as you, as you and or siblings, cousin, whoever this is, okay? Everybody's story is different, yeah. You stood up. So I'm standing up here. King of Wands, male or female. Doing the noble thing. You're watching it burn. You have a lot of strength and courage. Somebody has a lot of power here, okay? And they're going to be contacting you. They assess the situation. They see that you have self-mastery here. And your family don't, okay? They scapegoated you. They were working you or trying to work this person. Yeah, see through the illusions, right? Running out of options. They don't have a choice. Now they're, they're shitting bricks because you're going to be taking some action. You have authority. You have power. Judgment's been, they're under divine judgment, like I said. And it's ruined because you're stable and secure. And whatever they did to you, it's, it's a clap back, world in reverse. And it's an empty victory. Congratulations. Okay? Can't make it up. That's the way it came out. So awareness. They were unaware. Okay. They were doing magic. They were shit talking. They were manipulating. They were very deceptive. Two-faced. Involved with crime or, or corruption. Scattered. Not focused here. So five. Financial and material changes. They wanted to change you financially. Yeah. They wanted to gain off of this. Right. Good luck with that one. Okay. This is a dark high priest in the reverse. But here if it reverse, or they broke the law. Or both. Okay? Or all of it. Take it for whatever it is. This could be a divorce, a separation, it could be a false contract. Whatever this is, somebody didn't listen to advice. They gave poor advice. And now, well, Bob's your uncle. Caught a case, sexual infection, sexual disease, and rash. Mm -mm -mm. So if they're dealing with the health board, maybe they went around and still slept with people. Or they accused you of this. Doctoring papers. Well, that's federal. Car less, no car repo, car issues. Conceited, big ego. Social services. Pride, self-esteem, self-worth, and ego. You have self you have self-esteem. These people don't. That's why they're egotistical. They're prideful. Okay? And conflict. Yeah, you bypassed all this conflict. You're not fighting with these assholes. They want you to quarrel with them so they can say, see, they're out of control. Nah, they're confidence men and or women, okay? They hate your confidence. Something to do with a partner, told you. STD, what I say? Yeah, affair. They're going to say that you were the third party? No. Somebody's very power hungry, okay? Something to do with the inter internet and fear. So somebody's going to try to either 
threaten you by saying, I'm going to post this on the internet and go right a fucking head. I'll see you in court. I'll see you behind bars. Because you know the truth. So don't be afraid. Don't be afraid. If anybody listens to their fucking bullshit, then those people don't belong in your life either. Okay? If you listen to gossip. So, but don't be afraid. If they're threatening to, I'm going to say this online, and blah, blah. Go right ahead. Go ahead. Call their bluff. Go right ahead. Did you know that blackmail is a crime too? Oh, yes. <laughs> Go right ahead. You got nothing to hide. Walk through life with confidence. Don't let these people fucking bully you over. Don't let them fucking, you know, instill fear in you. Because once that fear gets in you, then, you know, they can do and say whatever. Nah. Are we ending this place for you guys? Guardian angels, ancestors, Lord. I was find a message here for the collective. Time for a nap. It's not time for that. It's time for them to wake up. 24 in reverse is 6 in reverse is the lovers in reverse. They're karmic, okay? They're nothing but karmic. There's a false contract out there. It's all one-sided. They made a bad decision. They could have chosen a karmic over a divine being. Well, that's their shit. Their tough luck, okay? Yep, the fates are involved here. You're, divine, you're divinely protected, 17. That's a star. You could be out in the public eye. This is their... You have a lot of... You have a lot of faith. This is... Wishes are being granted. Um, you could be on your north node. Divine intervention. You're an inspiration. You're a healer. You're very balanced. You're healthy. So if they're trying to say you're not, nah. You're, you're very healthy. Okay, congratulations. Wishes are being granted. Leg up and reverse. They've been stopped. That's the seventh chariot. They've been stopped. Or they, they lost their car. <laughs> Whatever. But they've been stopped. They can't go any further. They don't want to take accountability, but they're going to have to. Okay. This is somebody that has no direction in life, no structure, no discipline. Higher powers involved, I knew it. Four. Four is the emperor. He's the divine's a father, right? But somebody, you took back your power, you bossed up. You could be a leader, a spiritual leader. Higher powers involved. You could be a judge, could be anybody. But your third eye is lit and they tried to affect it. Nah. That face here in her in her heart chakra. Um, position here. So you have somebody in your heart that you're fond of in memory. I just heard it in memory of. So you could have lost somebody. My, my condolences because of this horse shit, because of this magic, the, these games. But you know that they're not gone. They've just moved on to a different realm, right? You'll see them again. I want you to know that. So keep them tucked into your heart, okay? They're always with you. They hear you. They see you. You'll see them again. 24 in reverse is the protection message. So I'm not minimizing your pain. Please don't take it that way. I just realized. Okay. I'm just I'm trying to console um, what they did. They're going to have to answer for. Okay. So you're a human being, not a human doing. Is it possible you're suffering from workaholism? Could you be the one who thinks it's your job to save everyone, to be there for everyone, and to go, go, go until you can barely see straight? So you're a people pleaser. You've gone as far as you can. You've worked hard and nourished people and projects, but now you are an empty well and have no reserves for others or for yourself. Don't let your ego keep you going full speed when your body and spirit need rest. Exhaustion is calling you to stop what you're doing altogether and take a break. If you don't, the appearance of this card could portend a possible illness that stems from being totally overwhelmed. You will feel like a new person if you take that break, so do it now. So, heed their advice, okay? We should all do that anyways. It doesn't matter what's going on in our world, you know? 17, the fates. Fate, karma, acceptance. That there are things you cannot change and knowing what those things are. The serenity prayer sums up the meaning of this card. So there could be a lot of addictions going on here. God grant me the serenity to accept the things I cannot change. The courage to change the things I can. And the wisdom to know the difference. There are things in life you will not, never have control over. The conditions brought on by the evolution of the collective, by nature, and by your past experiences may be faded preordained by spirit for a greater purpose you cannot understand in this lifetime and it may not be in your cards to understand why certain events occurred but you can accept the mystery and work with what those events and your current circumstances have to teach you this is the wisdom contained in the serenity prayer 
34 in reverse, the protection message. Are you always insisting on doing everything yourself? Do you have little faith that help will come? Convinced that the burden of the world is doomed to remain on your shoulders? So you've taken on a lot of burdens here on your own. Um, this is two cards stating that, okay? you got to look out for you, number one, right? Your beliefs about going it alone need to be discarded as they do not serve you at all. Let others help you. Yes, it will make you feel vulnerable to admit you need a helping hand. But to be vulnerable is good, for you have a lesson to learn. You must let someone else assist. You can't do life, quote-unquote, all by yourself. Once you shift your expectations, you'll, you'll be ama amazed by how quickly help arrives to give you a leg up. Let's end this with one of these guys. One of the angels. Let's see. Angels, what's the parting message here, please? How would you like to end this reading? The sun, truth, clarity, exposure, illumination. Happy, healthy, wealthy, wise, right? 64, it's, it's movement, it's change, it's the will of fortune. Destiny. The vivifying God, they're getting their karma, okay? Restoration of life, protection from adversaries, rabies, and wild beasts. Here, if you're spiritually high ranking, or this is the divine, or you're going dealing with an institution, a marriage, a contract, okay? Nine, has yell. As an investigation, you're shining a light on something. You've been alone up until this point. So somebody's figured out, you've been alone, you've been going up against these people, lots of people I just heard, by yourself, and yet they still lose. What's that say about them? Divine forgiveness obtains friendship and favors of the great, secures promises. Queen of Swords, you're speaking your truth, and you're setting boundaries, and you're cutting the, these people out, okay? 38, you're getting some justice. Congratulations. God the, hope of all, God, the hope of all the earth. Ritual and ceremony can acquire all the treasure, treasures of heaven and earth. So somebody was doing rituals and ceremonies. Uh, the, the sword's of flame in here. It's on fire. I do know Archangel Uriel has the flaming sword. He's the angel of redemption as well. So these people are going to have to, if they want redemption, they have to atone. Three of Wands, you're, you're moving on here. They, they, I think they covered your eyes for a lot of this stuff. They didn't want you knowing a lot, okay? It could be a divine feminine here, a mother of pregnancy. But I think um, there was a lot of chaos going on, a lot of shit talking, a lot of crap. So you had to do this by yourself, blindly using your intuition congratulations but i think that's also part of you developing your your spiritual gifts you had to go through it to develop your spiritual gifts okay so sitiel the god of hope construction of the universe help with great works protection from adversaries you are always protected six of swords you're moving on see that's also protection spiritual protection spirit plucked you out of rough waters and bringing you into calm waters to heal 63 it's another nine an investigation i'm picking up an investigator is going to come and see you and um the gentle god six of swords or you might have to go see them at a distance perception of unity protects against accidents and heals the sick so somebody's putting on an uh, an act like yeah there there's unit there's unity between you and them and there's not maybe you don't even speak to them Yep, I told you, Archangel Uriel's here. It's a tower. They're bringing it down, okay? This was built on a false foundation, giving off a false sense of security and false impressions. It's going to happen swiftly, too. It's, it's meant to redirect you where you need to go. Uriel's got his, his orders, and he's going to carry it through. Disruption, warns of disasters, aids in transformation. So some people are going to be transforming. Yeah? Eight of Pentacles has something to do with your job. They're being investigated. Yeah, hangman here. They wanted you struggling and or they tried to sacrifice you. Something's happening quickly here. But you, this is also um, self-mastery. You've done a lot of work on yourself and it shows. You've mastered whatever this is. So congratulations, okay? You're totally surrounded by spirit, by the angels. The divine's on it too, I feel. Whatever they've done to you and to others, I'm picking up. It's not the first time they've done this, Okay. So these people could be scam artists, and they've been doing it over and over again, but this time your family's involved. So the whole kit and caboodle's going to be blowing up, all thanks to you. <laughs> Sticking to your, um, your integrity, your morals, your ethics, your, you know, having a lot of honor, not caving into, giving in to these people. Congratulations. I hope you like to read. Until next time, take care.